Hello and welcome to this short video on how you can get the most from Facebook ads to help you grow your tutoring company. Last year I went on a training day that has completely transformed the way I use Facebook ads and the results I get from them. Before I just write my post, put it on the Star Tutoring Facebook page and click the boost button and hope for the best. With this video, I'm going to take you from the point where you've created your audience, your budget and everything else, and actually look at creating the ad itself. What you need is to know what people are going to respond to, and inevitably it's not always what you'd expect it to be. I admit this task is going to be time consuming, however, it will be worth it. For each advert you produce, you're going to need to create a range of variations to see which one will get the best response from your audience. You will eventually end up with 27 different designs for your advert. From here you can establish which one people responded to the most and which advert will cost you the least. Now you know the best performing advert, you can focus your marketing budget on this. For each advert you create, you're going to need to produce three different images. In each image, keep the text to a minimum and remove it completely if possible to help meet Facebook's criteria. Ideally, you want your first image to be that of your happy smiley face. The second image, something to do with what you're advertising. And thirdly, you want one of an animal or nature or something along those lines. OK, now you've come up with your three images, you need to create three individual pieces of text. The first one needs to be really short and precise. The next one will be mid-length, offering a bit more detail, basically enough to cover the basics. And with the third one, you need to give the most information. You need to include information about you and your company's background. OK, step three. Now you've got your images and your text, you need to come up with three separate headlines. The images I showed you previously were some I used to encourage people to download some templates that I'd made to help their children learn their times tables. So in this instance, the headlines I might use could be along the lines of make learning times tables fun, be creative when learning the times tables. Need some inspiration on teaching times tables and making it fun? Now you've got your three images, your three headlines and your three bits of text. You're going to create multiple adverts as follows. Let me explain it in more detail. Using the first image, you're going to put it with the first headline and the first piece of text. Then using that same image and same headline, you're going to put it with the mid-length piece of text. And then finally, using that first image with the first headline, you're going to put it with a long piece of text. So already I've created three of my adverts. What I should have said was, Ideally, you probably want to put your text as a Microsoft Word document so that you can just keep copying and pasting it and not having to rewrite it each and every time. So then we use our first image, of our second headline and first piece of text. We then use the same image again with the second headline and second piece of text and finally the, and finally the second headline and the third long piece of text. Then finally, using that first image, we would then go on and use the third headline with our short piece of text, with our mid-length piece of text, and our long piece of text. So now from that one image, I've created nine different adverts. If I continue to do this with all three images, I'll create 27 different adverts to experiment with. I'll go into a lot more detail on how to set up Facebook for ads in this month's training in the tutors group. What is the Tutors Group? It's a membership group where those of you who are looking to start or grow their own tutoring company can find inspiration, motivation and support. Each month I will add a new training bundle showing you techniques that you can use in your business such as resources or to grow your business such as this month's support on Facebook ads. Because the Tutor Group is still new, I'm going to offer it initially at just £8 a month. No matter how the price goes up in the future, whilst you remain a member, you will not be asked to pay a penny more. And, for anyone who joins this month, your name will be put into a hat. Whoever gets their name drawn out of that hat, I will produce for them the 27 adverts to get them going, along with a £50 marketing budget. What happens if you choose to join today to be entered into that competition but change your mind and decide to leave tomorrow? That's absolutely fine. 
You're not tied into any contract, so you can leave at any time. So, how do you join? Message me at info at startutoring.co.uk and I'll send you the link. And I'll also make sure your name is entered into the competition. Good luck, and I look forward to meeting you properly in the tutors group.